Let's just play with the throttle a little bit. Definitely louder with that sunroof open. Woo! Listen to that, guys. It don't get old. I can literally take this car out every single day. <laughs> Walmart, grocery stores, just to get gas. To the bank, wherever, guys. And I'm going to be smiling from ear to ear because that's all I hear. What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy, Dr. Horsepower, and we are back with another banger. Now, today, not only are we going to be going over why my Hellcat Supercharger is actually a little bit louder than most of your Hellcats out there, but we're also going to be going for a little ride, a little POV action, and I'm going to let you guys hear it for yourself, not only from the inside, but from the outside of the vehicle as well, and you guys can drop your comments down in the comment section. So let's dive into the differences from my Hellcat to most other ones. We all know that when you pop the hood, every single Hellcat, for the most part, they're going to look the same. You're going to have this massive intake you're gonna have this big silver supercharger sitting on top of your engine bay and then that big 6.2 liter hemi engine now the difference is first of all this air intake this right here is a open box intake the air actually flows in through here which originally comes in right through there and dumps it straight into here now all hellcats have a intake system but the majority of them out there are older Hellcats and they have a closed box system. So you're not getting any of this fresh air dumped right into here. Also the sound, the suction coming from here that's produced by the, um, the twin screws in there, it's enclosed. So you're already limited on your sound. Next up, let's talk about the supercharger. Although that supercharger looks just like the rest of them, it's actually a bit bigger so my supercharger actually comes it's a 2.7 liter pushing out about 14.5 pounds of boost but your typical hellcat most of the ones that you see out there and when i say typical there's nothing wrong with that i'm just saying the majority of hellcats that you see out there in the streets are going to come pushing uh what is it like 11.5 pounds of boost and their supercharger is actually smaller it's like a 2.4 i believe so that is a huge difference maker there so we've talked about the open versus closed box air intake we've talked about the bigger supercharger now let's talk about the engine as a whole so this car actually pushes eight 107 horsepower guys not the 707 that you normally see in your hellcats not the 717 that you see in the hellcat gel brakes or whatever it is that pushes the 717 there's even one that pushes 797 this is none of those this one right here is 807 horsepower guys this is basically the engine out of the demon it is out of the demon out of the super stop thrown into this charger now granted the demon horsepower does make 808 horsepower you'll never feel the difference between 808 and 807 this one is just tuned down one horsepower literally thank you dodge that was really weird so 807 but i will give credit to the demon i think it's capable of running off e85 which will push you up north of like 840 but anyway that's off subject so that's the difference guys the open box the bigger supercharger more horsepower power this green belt right here which allows you to have the additional boost now there is one more thing that comes on my hellcat that isn't on most of it and that is the supercharger chiller system so if you look right here i actually have the capability of turning my ac off in the car and making it dump that cold air right here to cool off my supercharger to keep it pushing out as much boost as possible that's enough talking that's enough of me running my mouth let's get these cameras set up i'm gonna run two of them so you can hear this sound from the inside of the car and the outside of the car and then you guys can be the judge yourself let's dive in Does that get old? Does that get old? What is up crew? So before we dive in, I start really showing you guys what this car sounds like. I got to give a big shout out to all my new subscribers that just joined me during this last video. Guys, I think I must have had my last video that I talked about how much I paid for this car. I must have had at least 4,500 views within like the first week, which is absolutely crazy. There are more views than there are subscribers. 
guys i absolutely love it so much love poured in the video before that i actually had to make comments on about how many haters i had and all the negative comments but with this newest video man guys y'all just dump love and support my ways so just know i truly truly appreciate it i read all comments and i try to get back to all you guys so i really appreciate it but that's enough talking let's get into what we're here for which is the beautiful sound of this car here we go i think i found the, i think i found the perfect back road for this not sure how good it's picking up that supercharger wound but with no throttle right now you can already hear check this out gosh dude it doesn't get old listen to these downshifts listen to this that freaking supercharger is so crisp one more time so i have my camera set up out there outside the car fourth gear oh man bring them downshifts back bring them back I really hope that the camera out front isn't picking up too much wind noise. Here we go. Let's try this. Let's open up the sunroof for you guys. It's actually extremely hot in here anyway. I have the AC off because I want you guys to be able to hear nothing but supercharger sound. Let's just play with the throttle a little bit. Definitely louder with that sunroof open. Woo! Listen to that, guys. It don't get old. I can literally take this car out every single day. <laughs> Walmart, grocery stores, just to get gas. To the bank, wherever, guys. And I'm going to be smiling from ear to ear because that's all I hear. Now, I do got to say to all my Hellcat owners out there, don't think that I'm down in your Hellcat, the 707 horsepower or the older Hellcats. Much love, much love. Love my Mopar family. I was just strictly making this video just in comparisons of their supercharger sound. Your sound beautiful as well especially when you go out and you get like a b woody or a jlt intake the open air boxes they sound just as good if not better but i just wanted you guys to hear the difference let's dive back in one more time one more pull before we end this video what do I, you know what i've been giving you guys like little small bumps on the throttle basically <laughs> basically like that but let me give you guys a wide open throttle i'll do like a uh, third gear wide open throttle pull let you guys hear what it sounds like when you're really getting on it get around this curve here we go all right <laughs> oh you gotta love it one more time And that's going to wrap it up, guys. Make sure that y'all smash that subscribe button before you click out of this video. And I appreciate all the love. And until next time, guys, peace.